Hey, hey, Spring La Fay, Simple Tarot. Okay, Aquarius, this is a reading for you. I've got you a stack of Oracle. We're going to put them here and we're going to take some tarot. I just did a, an Aries reading. Oh my goodness, you could cut the tension with a knife. Yeah, yeah. Whew, someone is being just pulled in like different directions. It feels like two, two or three directions. Yeah. Okay, Aquarius. Spirit, what does Aquarius need to know as far as money? Okay, about money. There's an illusion that you're not seeing. Woo! Luck is already with you and you're not even seeing it. There you go. Yeah, it's all in. You have to see it. You have to. Um, oh, it's on your side. You quit seeing yourself in a lack mentality. There you go. You got this. Oh, my goodness. Wow, that's got such a feel to it. It does. Okay, romantic love, romance. Okay, loss. Healing brings success. Okay, after having a loss where romance or, you know, uh, romantic love was lost, you need to, to have a success, you need to heal. Heal what has been hurt and you will have that success. Oh my goodness, it's got such a feel to it. It does, it does, it does. See, your just reward and your happiness will come. But you need to heal what has been hurt. What has been, you know, done to you. Heal it. Heal it and things will transform for you. But do use your imagination. Take that moment to have some self-reflection. Self and that also helps with your prosperity. Wow. And see, there's reflection again. Yeah. So, if you're at that crossroads, d d choose to heal what's been hurt. Choose to heal yourself. That is beautiful. Now, your oracle cards, romance-wise, we've got this one. It is safe for you to love. Open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all. And I feel like that this comes after you do that healing, you know. Um, once you do that healing, you know, if you look up there, we've got uh, dear old, um, oh my goodness, what's his name? It's waiting to shoot you. He ain't going to shoot you. He's just going to stab you with that arrow there. Cupid, we got Cupid up there just waiting, just waiting. Come on, come on, do that healing so I can just jab it. Yeah, <laughs> that's what, yeah. And then we have this beautiful card right here for you. And time. You are trying too hard. Give it time. So slow down. Give it time. Just just take the time you need to heal yourself. What you desire will come to you. Have faith. Trust. This one here, I got around money. I want you to look how bright that is. Uh, it's so bright. It's, it's just it's beautiful, but it's bright. Yeah, it's hard to see. So, yeah. You know, just like this moon card. It's hard to see through an illusion. Oh, yeah. Okay, your message from the universe. Eternity is a really, really, really long time. I think we'll be able to squeeze everything in. Relax. Peace and blue jeans, the universe. Wow, that's beautiful. Got you an angel message. Embrace those around you. And it's a number five. Fives are about change. Embrace those around you. Your message is, this is a time of great spiritual growth for you. Making it even more important to surround yourself with those who love you and share your beliefs. Be willing to accept help from others. You could find comfort in traditional solutions or your heart may long to try out new ideas. So that's what I have for you. Much light and love. Till next time. Bye.